Since Southern Utah joined the WAC last season, the Thunderbirds have won three of their last four against rival Utah Tech, including the last three in a row. It feels like you're your little brother or your big brother. It, it feels like that. We're, I mean, everybody talks about this game in town. On January 18th, SUU got the victory 75-65 to behind 23 points from both Dominique Ford and Prophet Johnson. It's just a fun, a fun rival, and we've been trying to do this for for quite some time and so when they joined the WAC we were really excited for that because we knew we'd play them twice every year um, and it's one of our biggest games for our fans and for our community and we can't wait to, to get started. John Judkins is in his 19th season in St. George since the loss to SUU last month. The Trailblazers are one in four. To get back in the win column Judkins says they need to get back to basics. When we defend our big thing last couple of weeks has been guard your yard play defense without foul and play defense before your guy gets the catch. I mean, we've been stressing that the last couple of weeks. Utah Tech and Southern Utah tip off at 7 p.m. Mountain Time, live on ESPN Plus and various regional sports networks. Tarleton State is at Utah Valley. The Texans have won three in a row. UTRGV visits Stephen F. Austin. The Lumberjacks are looking to get on track after losing three of four. Abilene Christian makes the trip to Seattle U. The Red Hawks have won three of their last four. And UT Arlington is a California Baptist. The Mavericks are on a two-game win streak. For the Road to Wag Vegas, I'm Eric Danner.